Hey, it's great to be with you again today. I've been thinking about forgiveness a lot lately, and um, not not that I've done anything wrong, right? So, but, you know, I've been thinking about it, and uh, I was reading scripture this morning and my devotions, and Jesus is talking to the disciples, and um, he is specifically speaking with Peter, and Peter is, I, he's the unofficial spokesman for the disciples. He's a little older than the other guys, and he's one of Jesus's closest um, com companions, and he, he says to Jesus, he says, hey, I, how many times should I forgive somebody who sins against me? Should I, should I forgive them seven, seven times? Which is more than double what the Jewish law called for the, so Peter's trying to go above and beyond, right? And Jesus looks at him, he says, Peter, you know what? That's, that's pretty cool. Seven times is a lot, but you should forgive somebody 70 times, seven times. 70 times seven, seven times zero is zero. Seven times seven is 49. 490 times, Jesus? I gotta, I gotta, I'm gonna have to take off my shoes and socks, right? And, and the point is, Jesus is saying, man, you should forgive until forever. You just don't count. You just keep forgiving. And, you know, when we hear that, we get the hair up on the back of our necks and we're like, you expect me to forgive somebody who keeps sinning against me and sinning against me and sinning against me like 490 times, Jesus, that's ridiculous. You know, that's a lot of forgiving. And I don't think I can forgive anybody that many times. And, and, and right, and we get all, you know, right? Our, our traps get all up on us, right? And we start to get all self-righteous, just kind of like what Peter did. And then, and then we need to be forgiven. You see, all right, it's all well and good to not forgive others until we need forgiveness for something that we've done, something we've said, somehow we've hurt someone or damaged someone's uh, business or their character or we've, right? And we, and then, well, you, you just need to get over it. You need to forgive me. You know, you need to, and then it's a whole different story, right? Then we want that forgiveness, that unconditional forgiveness from someone. And that 490, well, it better come into play because I, you know, there's times when I sin a lot, you know, and I think we all know that we have uh, thoughts that come into our head that are sinful at times, right? We say things that are sinful. We act out sinfully sometimes against our brothers and our sisters, and we need to ask for forgiveness. And can you imagine if we went to God and he said, ah, sorry, already forgiven you seven times, man. You're out of luck this time. Uh, call back later. Maybe I've got some time for you. Maybe, you know, if I get my calculator out, uh, right? We need forgiveness. We need to be forgiven. And we need to forgive others unconditionally. May God continue to pour out his grace, mercy, and blessings on each and every one of us until we get to meet again. Amen? Amen.